In this video, I am going to show you how it is that you would embed a Hopkins Apps calendar into your Moodle page because Hopkins Apps, in terms of a classroom calendar, is probably easier to update and um, smoother than using the um, built-in calendar option in Moodle. So just notice that in the upper right hand corner here, I am logged into my apps account. So you definitely want to start there in your calendar program. The other thing I want to uh, show you is that if you look over on the left hand side under my calendars, you can see that I have two calendars here. One is for things that I'm personally doing. So the, the things in this calendar that are blue are for meetings and things of that nature. And then the second one I set up is a classroom calendar. And so I'm gonna show you how is it that you could embed a classroom calendar into your Moodle page. So those are the things that are in the rust color. If you do maintain a classroom calendar, you wanna click on the little triangle next to that classroom calendar and go down to share this calendar. Here you wanna make sure that you've made it public because to ensure that it is embedded and showing to everybody in your Moodle page, you wanna make it as public as possible. And there's really probably nothing in there that you is really private information. So make sure you put a check mark in front of share this calendar with, with others and make it public, um, which is even um, available to people outside of our district. That is going to ensure that you don't have issues with it showing up in Moodle. So then if you wanna embed it in Moodle, what you do is you are going to go under here to calendar settings and then you're going to have to copy some computer code and so it's this wacky code right here it looks sort of weird um, but that is really the code that uh, will display it in Moodle it's called the embed code so what I want to do is I want to customize that so I'm going to click on customize color size and other options and instead of having a gigantic calendar like that, I'd like to get it into the right or left column. And for that, I like to have the agenda view. So I'm gonna click on agenda and I want it to be about 250 pixels wide, which is about two and a half inches because about 100 pixels in an inch. So if I make those changes, it's gonna look something like this in Moodle. So after you go through and you tinker with what you want it to look like, then you can go back up to this code, you select all of it, and then you're gonna copy it. So edit, copy, or command C. Then you'll go to your Moodle page, and what you're gonna do is you're gonna embed it in a block, in either right column or the left column. So I'm gonna turn my editing on on the Moodle page. And at this point, I could delete these other blocks called latest news and calendar because I'm not gonna use the built-in Moodle calendar. I wanna embed this one. So I'm gonna add a, what we call an HTML block and that's really just a custom block where you can put anything in there. So then I click on the edit icon and then I am going to go into the code and to do that I need to toggle on the HTML and this is where all the code goes and so I simply paste command V or edit edit paste what I had copied when I was in my calendar and then I'm going to click save changes this brings me back to my page I'm going to turn editing off so you can see what this looks like and you can see now anytime I make an update or a change to my calendar it will be reflected because really this right hand column is a mirror into the, um, the Google Calendar. And what's great is on a Google Calendar, you can add some details. So for instance, if I click on the mono hybrid problems, you can see that I can even add a description there with some details. If a student were logged into Moodle, so in the upper right hand corner, if they were a logged in user, they could click on copy to my calendar and that would actually move that detail to their own personal calendar, which I think is another great function of using the, Moodle calendar, the Google Calendar embedded in Moodle.